A group of would be home buyers in Keswick are disappointed and angry. Their dreams shattered after the company that was supposed to be building their houses abruptly cancelled their contracts without notice. They believe it's thanks to the red hot real estate market. We want our home, homes back. You know, my husband and I are living in our parents' basement right now because we've been priced out of the market. And it's, it's not fair. You know, we've sold our home thinking we had our dream home, our retirement home, and now we've lost it. The builder is Park Avenue Homes, and the development project was for 28 three- and four-bedroom detached and semi-detached homes in the Queensway subdivision. They were purchased at the beginning of 2016 at prices ranging from $550,000 to $720,000. Instead, they all got this letter from a lawyer, along with their returned deposits, that stated, Unfortunately, due to circumstances not within my client's control, the conditions relating to early termination were not satisfied. As a result, your agreement of purchase and sale became void. It's not clear what these conditions are, but the buyers think they know what's going on. Homes have, you know, in Keswick has gone up roughly 60% year over year. We all feel um, amongst us that he's probably um, let us let our deals go so that he could turn around and resell the homes. Annette Georgiev says she was told that the property was no longer going to be developed, but she's taken numerous pictures that show work is being done at the site. If he's not developing this land, why is it like this? Ten of the 28 buyers have come together as a group to fight for their cause. They'd all been thrilled about their new homes they thought they'd be moving into in March of 2018. And they all had big plans. Dinesh Ratna Singham's wife changed jobs to be closer to the new house, and his twin brother had also bought two doors down. We were looking forward to starting a family together. He's expecting a child. Yes. So, you know, our kids growing up together. Yeah. And we were devastated when we heard the news. We bought our house in anticipation of starting a family. And, well, right after we bought the house, we got pregnant with <laughs> yeah. twins. Yeah. Yeah. And now these buyers say comparable homes are going for close to a million or more, prices they can't afford. They've contacted Tarion, which is Ontario's home warranty agency and regulator of builders, but so far they felt unsupported and that they have no recourse. Right now, we're really not getting for sure answers why we've lost our home. I reached out to Park Avenue Homes and the marketing firm that represents it, but did not hear back. As for Tarion, a spokesperson told me they are looking into the matter and urge anyone else who's been affected by this to contact them.